So welcome uh, again. I uh, will solve in this uh, recording exercise uh, 4.2 from the booklet, so page 55. So again, you can check the description below to check the uh, question and uh, the written solution. Uh, so we are asked here to write a program that displays the quotient and the remainder of the integer division of two integers entered on the keyboard as well as the rational quotient of those numbers so so we have to read two integers from the keyboard and the program should display the quotient the remainder of the integer division and the rational quotient of these numbers so we need two integer numbers so we have to read in two integers and we need to make a division so we need to pay extra attention to the division since an integer over an integer will give us an integer so int let's say a comma b so the user should enter two integers so we need to use uh, percentage d so the address of a and the address of b so as we already said we need to give a clues to the user in order to know what to enter what kind of variables the numbers and stuff like that so we we'll ask him please enter two integers and then we need to display the quotient so the quotient so if we divide a over b let's run it and let's take an example so if we say 5 and 2 the quotient will be a 2 so how we can get 2 so we need to divide 5 by 2 and we should get the integer part so since it's an integer so we can either do it uh, let's say version 1 so in version 1 we'll be using version 1 one so version one what we'll do is we will print the solution directly the answer directly so we will say the quotient is equal to percentage d and the quotient is a over b so let's run the program so no it's not the bug forget about it no debug so it's run 5 so we'll enter two numbers 5 and 2 and yes we will have the quotient equal to 2 so this is version 1 version 2 so we can declare a variable of type integer called quotient and then we fill it so version 2 version 2 we can say that quotient is equal so it's a small q is equal to a over b and then we will display the a over b so let's run it again and we will enter two integers 5 and 2 and yes we will have the quotient so we can either choose one of these i will keep both and let's continue with uh, the second part we need the remainder so if we divide 5 by 2 the quotient will be 2 and the remainder uh, will be equal to 1 so how can we get the remainder so we can use the modulo operator so here again so the remainder is equal to a modulo b so modulo it means that we divide a by b and what it remains it will be the answer of a modulo b so in our example it should be equal to 1 so i'll rerun the same example so 5 and 2 and yes the remainder is equal to 1 let's take uh, another example let's say that we have 1 and 2 so 1 over 2 it's 0 0.5 so the quotient will be 0 and the remainder will be equal to 1 which is correct so the third part is 
we need to raise the durational quotient. It means that if I give him 1 and 2, so the durational quotient is 0 0.5. So if I do the same thing here, it will be equal to 0 because let's run it again so 1 over 2 it is 0 so this is wrong because we know already that an integer over integer is equal to a float so what we should we can do so we have multiple solutions version 1 is to use the casting so I transform so I force the type of one of the variables to be of type for example uh, double or float and here I should change it to a double so this is version 1 let's run it it's LF okay stop LD it means long double so LF run one and two so yes now it's equal to 0 0.5 the second solution is not to use the casting but to multiply since we have a division and a, a division a over b so we can multiply one of these operands by 1.0 so when one of these uh, operands are double or real so the second will be converted to real and the division will be of type 3 so we will run it again so 1 and 2 the answer also is 0 0.5 so I will just make a remark here that I will reuse in fact the version 1.0 but in the wrong way so version 1 wrong so what if I do like this if I apply the casting on A over B. So as we know by um, the rules of priorities that we have seen in chapter 4, so we need to solve what's in, inside the bracket. So inside the parentheses we have A over B. So 1 A is integer and B is integer. So the division is an integer. So A over B would be equal to 0. So 0 I will modify it. I will promote it to a double type so the answer will be 0 0.0000 so I will keep it here and say it's wrong so let's rerun it again and put the same example so yes this is wrong because we'll end up with 0 0.00 so you should be aware that whenever you use casting you should apply it just on one variable not on the whole uh, expression so uh, this is done for this uh, exercise so do not forget that for any questions do not hesitate to contact me and to subscribe this is to this channel and to turn on the notification by hitting the bell icon so for this so this is it for this exercise and see you on the next one